Okay, it's kind of odd that um, this the, the the scary violent stuff. You could tell the kids that anything about sex, you're not supposed to talk to kids. It didn't used to be that way. Um, and the idea that certain kids need to be shielded from even this gruesome, scary stuff is kind of new. Um, if you look at uh, fairy tales, actually, you know, over the course of time, they get cleaned up uh, from the beginning where, you know, anything goes, they're just like totally sex and violence all the time uh, to being more and more euphemistic. So you kind of have to figure out what's really going on to the point where it's all disnified as it is now. Um, I'm not quite sure why that is. One theory is that the innocence of childhood was actually invented during the Industrial Revolution. You know, during the 15 and 1600s, it was just considered totally normal. In fact, children were considered to be sort of wicked and, and devilish because they were tainted by original sin. This is what Puritans say. You have to beat the sin out of them. Um, and it's only once uh, people's homes, these are also children were your workforce, right? You were employing them from a very young age. It's only when the home and the workplace was separated from the invented factories and offices and the kind of modern model uh, that people felt that women and children needed to be protected from the real world. They were innocent creatures. And, and it was around that time also that you have a division of class such that people didn't really hear the original fairy tales anymore. They didn't grow up with them. Um, in fact, people have said there's only been like one generation between the last person who probably middle class person who grew up being told a fairy tale by their nanny or their kind of working class governess or whoever was taking care of them, maid. Um, and uh, when they suddenly, the romantics suddenly rediscover the book and realize that fairy tales exist. You know, they'd only forgot for a little while. But when they, then they were like, whoa, this isn't fit for children at all. We have to clean it up.